بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Today there will be 100 day left for Obama before he can close Guantanamo. I've been asked by a friend of mine and of one of my supporters and someone who's been striving on this close Guantanamo campaign for a long time. Most of you know him. His name is Andy Worthington. He's actually the one who's filming this. And uh, he asked me to give a message to President Obama. And uh, for a long time, before even I got freed from Guantanamo, I knew for no doubt that Obama wants to close Guantanamo. And I believed him. And I still believe he wants to do it. But unfortunately, I felt like he need the strength to close Guantanamo from within himself, not from the outside. He need to believe on what he's doing is right. Not wait for everybody to approve what he's doing. Because most of the time, if we want to do something, we will find a lot of people against of what we want to do. So my message to him, if you really want to be a hero, if you really want to be a great man who do something to bring peace to the world, to bring an end of Guantanamo, you just need to shut it down. You need to look forward and just do it. There is so much things happening in Guantanamo that a whole, the whole world doesn't know about. Until now, I didn't talk about it because I'm not ready to talk about it yet. But there is so much going on there that I'm sure that we need to close that place down. And I'm sure you know so many things that happening there is not right. First of all, keeping somebody all these years behind bars, in cages, without any communication with the outside world, in the name of what? Of justice? You have to know that even if these people did something wrong, they already served their time and they need to go back to their families. And I hope President Obama in this 100 days that he really think to do something out of the ordinary and try to really do something without looking around him, making sure that everybody approve what he's doing. Carry the, as I say, carry the torch in this dark time that we are living. And le lead and go forward with it. And let the light go in front of everybody to see it in front of them that you are doing it. Without hesitating that you are doing the right thing. Even if they ab don't approve you today, but I have no doubt in the future, the whole world will remember that you did something great. Because closing that place is going to help the whole world, not just the people inside Guantanamo. Because that place is influencing a lot of other countries to start the same thing. And we know that a lot of countries nowadays, they're thinking of doing their own Guantanamo. So please, before something like this start, close Guantanamo and shut that place down. That's my message to you and to your government. And I hope that you will succeed to do it as soon as possible. Thank you.